what is going on guys it is so good to see y'all again all right i know this doesn't look really i know this doesn't really look like anything much right now but i have an idea i want to wear you know most of the time when you guys go bashing or rc racing you just throw all of it in the back of the truck or in the back of the pickup and you go and then you just kind of work off the floor i want some organization I want lights, I want power strips, I want shelving, and I want it to look decent. So I thought that I would build this thing out of wood, which I did. I didn't bother putting that in the video. There was no point. You kind of see the end result. Um, I had to cut the leg off though. It was too uh, short. So I'm gonna secure the leg back and set it up inside there. So hopefully this will be a good idea for you guys. If you wanna take your bashing to the next level, this is it. We're going to paint this real quick. I might as well paint it and get done with it before I secure it in the truck and do all the other crap to it, right? Right. So let's paint it. We're going to go with just a regular black simple. Ta-da! It's not perfect, but you know what? It'll do. It is already starting to look pretty good. Okay, question. How do you keep it secure? Because as you can see, one little touch, it would just fall over. I was looking. My truck has these anchor points here, right? On each side of the truck. I'm thinking about using these. So I could just kind of run it through like that and then secure it into the wood. And that will hold this thing. That'll keep it from, it'll help secure it, that's for sure. I don't think it will do the trick, but it'll definitely help with the swaying. Um, ultimately, if you want to, you could probably take a small screw and run a screw down and into this. This is just a hard piece of plastic. And a little screw, I don't think it would make that much of a hole to where you would even see it. So we're gonna go with this idea first. And if that doesn't 100% help, then we'll go with that idea. Here. Oh yeah. Uh, it passed the wiggle test. The only problem though is now is that it can go forward. So I think what I'll do is I'll run one, one screw through here, anchoring it down, and hopefully that will 100% secure it. I got these two pieces, right? They're made of plastic with double-sided Velcro tape on that and on this. And what I'm gonna do with this is I'm gonna screw it in like that and then this will stick to that and that will hold it up also since there's velcro on the bottom i found that this is really sticky if you stick it to there see that <laughs> all right there's that let's see here and it will ho ho Yes. Awesome. I mean, it might vibrate off, but I mean, if I need to, I can just take them down when I'm transporting it, right? And then I can just stick them up. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's repeat to the other side. I want to add though, 
I did have a couple things in mind. One, I want to be able to put the seats back up, right? Done. I can put the seats up and it not hit that. Also, I don't want to completely lose the back of my truck. So I left a little bit of space up top so that way I can see out the back. I mean, some is better than none, right? Right, yes, guys, look at this. Just look at it, wonderful wonderful just what i needed i have lights i have storage i have power supplies i got usb plugs man and i got plenty of room to work on the truck and i even turn these into a tire rack and what i'll do is i'll wire up a bungee so that way you can stretch a bungee across it and hook it to the other side That'll keep the tires from rolling out. And our spotlights look incredible. They work very well. Um, it's a little too bright out right now to kind of give you guys that idea, but you get the drift, right? Perfect lighting. Now, if that's not enough lighting at night, I'll check it out. Like tonight when I go to work, I'm going to check this out. We're going to see how this actually functions. Okay, so you pull up to your closest outlet, right? You open the door, you grab out your power plug, and you plug it in. Wow, what a difference. Usually about how much light I actually have to work with. Yeah, big difference. Make sure to subscribe, guys. Leave a like. Check out some of our other videos. If you guys like videos like this, help support us by leaving a like. I appreciate you guys and everything y'all do for me. See you guys in the next video. Man, this was an awesome idea. Cheap, cheap idea. I mean, this was, I was gonna throw it away, but what a genius move on my part. Oh yes, now it looks professional. Whew. All right, I'm, I'm done, y'all be cool.